So tell me, where are you from? Oh, I'm actually from Guinea-Bissau. Okay. Yeah, this is in West Africa, a small country, a Portuguese-speaking country. Okay, great. Yeah. Uh, why are you studying English? Uh, well, I'm studying English uh, because I have to study in English. Uh, I'm here uh, to prepare my TOEFL uh, score and um, yeah, the university I want to go is asking me to, to have a, a good base, of, especially in uh, American culture, to understand American, the way Americans speak uh, English. So that's why I'm here to, to do that. Okay. And very, it's very tough. <laughs> <laughs> All right, thank you. Uh, have you studied before, and if so, where? Uh, English, yes. You know, when you are going to school in Africa, especially, you will study English. But it's uh, British English, mm -hmm. and you have your basic uh, English uh, study to communicate. But this is not uh, really because I'm coming from a Portuguese-speaking country. I have done my studies in French, so. As a medical doctor, if you, you want to study medicine in Africa, especially in French-speaking countries, the books are in English. So you have to improve your English. It's not that um, real one that you, you, you can get to, to go to the high level of, uh, of English. So as I'm now in America, uh, I understand a lot of things that um, when uh, I have done this course, uh, I find out that uh, there is a lot of things we are missing, and we were missing in spelling, uh, the, the, the way to, to, to combine the things and the expressions. Uh, it's very, very important to know that and to understand people when they are reading um, the books and the newspaper, to understand the mind of people, what they what in their mind, what they want to bring out from this. And this is a very uh, important point. Yeah, yeah. absolutely. Good. Thank you. And uh, why do you like speak your mind? Oh, speak your mind is um, a really good and important program that I will myself recommend people to do. Because why I'm saying that is um, Speaking of mind is something that they, they are trying to remind you every day what you learned before. Mm -hmm. And this, if the world, for example, you try to, the new world you try to understand and the teacher is trying to, uh, to, to, to speak to you, to, to try to remind you. And every time this, you know, they say a repetition is a pedagogy. If you are repeating this one every time, you will have it in your mind all the time. And if you let two times, three times, you will be good. Mm -hmm. So speak and make is a very specific program to let people to, to speak uh, very quickly mm -hmm. the language and in uh, the specific culture. So that's very important. Mm -hmm. good. So you said you would recommend it to other people? Of course, this is the program that I'm recommending to my brothers and sisters, especially uh, we uh, Africans. Uh, as my wife used to say, is she said that it's not uh, the really English we are speaking in Africa. <laughs> if you want to speak English, come to this country, you will find out that. For example, in Africa, if you are, they ask you, how are you doing, or how are you? You say, I'm fine, thank you, or, I'm fine, thanks. But here, it's easier to say, how doing? <laughs> I'm great. <laughs> so, <laughs> so, it's something very um, important to show uh, lively uh, the way you, your behavior, uh, to understand the culture, the mind of people, mm -hmm. how they are, uh, yeah, the way they, they, they think every day yeah. about their lives. All right. Thank you very Thank much. You. You're